Hey guys, we're here to do another comparison of two grinders. We have the OXO Barista Brain versus the Baratza Encore Grinder. Hi, it's Gail from Seattle Coffee Gear, and I'm just gonna go over the features, the pros and cons, and why this might work for you, either one of these might work best for you. Let's look at the Barista Brain. This is relatively new on the market compared to the Encore. The Encore has been around a little bit longer. This grinder will do three different functions automatically for you. And let me get into the uh, menu here and I'll show you. Okay, I had to click it to make it come out of sleep. So you can do a uh, portafilter, you can, which is just on and then when you get what you need it goes off again you can do cups and you can program how many cups of coffee you want to do or it actually weighs down here and you can do grams so that's a nice feature right uh it comes with this container to collect for your drip coffee or whatever it is you're weighing you can weigh into this and it knows uh it tear you can tear this out down here it has a removable tray so that you can clean it a lot easier that's kind of nice too it also comes with 15 different settings on the grind up here. And this bean hopper actually removes as well. You can take this off by pushing that lever down and it locks this. So the beans aren't gonna go all over the place. That's a nice feature. And then your burrs are right there. And on both of these machines, since we're talking about burrs, they are both 40 millimeter conical hardened steel burrs. So they're both identical when it comes to that, as far as that aspect goes. Uh, you can choose your 15 settings up here, and then you also have five more plus or minus where you can fine tune it a little bit. And also weigh out your coffee. I'll get back to that. Well, I guess I could show you right now. Let's just get in here. Grams. I'm gonna ask it to do Two grams. Oh, let's do three. There, it did three grams. It weighed it. It's right down in there. There it is, three grams. Or if you want to get into cups, now you can change it to one, two, or three cups. And then if you want. Three cups, of, that's enough for three cups of coffee, and they have calculated this. You can obviously fine tune it. If you, if you don't think it's strong enough, the amount they put out for three cups, well, go up to six cups and then brew three cups. You know, it's one way around it. And then you can also get into the portafilter, which is manual. And you stop it. So that's basically, and then the other thing you can do on this uh, is you can actually tear it out as well. If you hold this on, and it's kind of a long hold. Uh, let's go to grams, and then we're gonna tear it out. Right now it says it has 24 grams. I'm gonna tear this container out. And it's a little bit of a long hold. Three, two, one, now it's teared out. So it's not recognizing there's anything in there at this point, and you can tear out any of the functions on it. So that's basically the OXO Barista Brain. Let's go over to the Encore by Baratza. This is a basic, this does not weigh, this is basic on and off. It has 40 settings versus the 15 plus five down here. So you have a little more flexibility when it comes to that. It holds uh, half a pound of beans. This one holds a pound of beans. You cannot take this bean hopper off without the beans going everywhere. So that's, a, that's one thing that's a little bit different. This one does have the button on the front. If you have your portafilter under there, put it under there. Let's pretend it's there. You can push, grind as much as you want down into your portafilter and then stop. So that's uh, the uh, Encore. I would say looks-wise, um, they're both, you know, this is a plastic case all around. This has a little bit of stainless. 
You know, I like the looks of both of them. I don't think the plastic on this one takes away from its looks on your countertop. So I mentioned on both of these that this one has an icon for portafilter, and this one has the button on the front that you dis can dispense into your portafilter. While they all both have that, it's really not going to be the best grinder, either one of these, if you don't have a pressurized portafilter. And even if you have a pressurized portafilter, I don't think you're going to get the best results. You're going to be way down at the bottom, and even then it might not be the best. So these are really good for drip, pour over, French press, something like that. But if you're going to espresso, jump it up a little bit, get a little different grinder. And of course, we can help you with that as well. So let me show you the consistency of what you're going to get from these. This one here is the Encore Coarsest, Encore Finest. Oxo Coarsest, Oxo Finest. What I noticed in the Oxo on the Coarsest is you get a inconsistencies. You get big chunkos, you get medium, and then you get fines with it. So that's not as consistent. Over here, yeah. Maybe pressurized, see, you can feel powdery, but it's got a lot of granular to it, too. The Encore, contrary, is a, yes, it, it's chunky and all that, but it's not as inconsistent. So it's a little bit more consistent. That's the word. And then fineness. Maybe just a little bit finer than the OXO, but again, I don't think either one of these is designed to do portafilters, uh, espressos. So, what would they be good for? Like I said, drip, pour over, or French press. Uh, if you, the one thing that this, the OXO does do, and at, at an entry level price, it weighs, a, it weighs and dispenses by cups. That's a nice feature, but if you really wanna get precise with weighing your espresso or whatever you're doing it for, uh, I would say you might want to get a standalone grinder. Uh, I'm sorry, not a standalone grinder. A standalone scale will be much more accurate if you're going to be using this where you really want to get accuracy. So while it has those features, it's again entry level price with those features. You're going to have to step it up, step your game up to a really high end scale if you want to get really fine tuned. But that's not what this is for. Use it for your uh, drip, pour over. Weigh it, perfect. Um, the Encore, I would say, consistency, great for pour over drip French press. And it's uh, been around for a long time. It's well built. And I think not having the scale, to me, is not a drawback at all. I would say, if you need a scale, get a standalone and along with this, you know, put a little more money into the scale if it's important to you. So that's the OXO Barista Brain versus the Encore by Barazza. Check them both out on our website. They're both there with the uh, specifications and all that kind of stuff. And comments down below. And call us if you have questions. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get all the notifications of when all this sort of stuff is posted. Check these out on our website and all the other grinders we offer. And I hope you guys have a great day.